Hello everyone, welcome back to Fleet and today I'm going to show you how to download and install mods for Minecraft. I'm going to be showing you how to do it for Forage and also for Fabric. Now I'm also going to be doing it for the newest version of Minecraft, but this will work with all versions of Minecraft. So it doesn't matter what version you are playing for Minecraft, this will still work. So first we're actually going to install Forage, so click on the link in the description down below to come to the Forage website. From here what we're going to want to do is actually select on the version of Minecraft we want to download. Now for me I'm doing the newest version of Minecraft as recording this video. And that is the Minecraft version 1.21.1. I'm going to click on that one just there. Now from here, what we can do is, is actually come over to the installer. Click on the installer just there. Now we'll have to wait 5 seconds for this ad to skip. So don't click anything in this ad just here. Just leave it. Then click on skip just over here. Now that will start downloading just here for us. We're also going to want some mods to play with Forage. So simply come to this website just here. I will leave a link in the description down below. And from here, what we can do is we can scroll down and actually search by the Forage mods. So click on the uh, Forage just there. Scroll down again, click on the game version, search by the game version you are using for Forage and also for Minecraft. So for me it is the version 1.21.1, click on that. Now from here we'll see all the mods that do work with the newest version of Minecraft. Simply from here scroll through, have a look for what mods you want to play. Now for me I'm actually going to be downloading this one just here, mouse tweaks. So just click on this one just here, then from here scroll down. And as you can see, over here we have the files icon just here, click on that. Then once you've clicked on that, scroll down again. And in here, what we're going to want to do is actually find the newest version of Minecraft, which is this one just here, 1.21.1. We're also going to want to make sure that we do have the forage just there. Then click on the three little dots on the end here, then click on download file. Now you will have to wait five seconds for this to download. So I'm now on my desktop and from here, go to your downloads folder. So mine is just here, I'm going to drag my files off to my desktop just like that. Click on close. Now as you can see, we have got two files just here. So now what you need to make sure is that you do have Java installed. So if you don't have a coffee mug in there, that means you don't have Java installed and you will need to get that installed. So there will be a link on the screen right now to a video you can watch I made on how to install Java. There's also a link in the description down below as well. So the first thing we're going to want to do is actually install the actual forage just here. So simply click on the forage, right click, open with, then click on Java just there, click on that. Now this will load up a little menu just like this one. Now from here, what we can do is click on OK just here, click on that. Now this will install, click on OK. You can now get rid of this file just here, so get rid of that one. So now what we're going to want to do is actually load up our Minecraft launcher. So our Minecraft launcher has now loaded. Simply from here, we want to make sure that forage is selected over here. Now if you don't see it here, click on the little arrow. It might be in here, so select it. If you still can't see it in here, click on installations at the top here. Make sure modded over here in the corner is selected. So make sure that there is selected. If you still can't see it here, click on new installation. On the versions just here, simply search for Forage. As you can see, we've got it just here. Click on that. Give it a name. Give it an icon. Then from there, click on Create down here. You only need to do this if you do not have Forage in here. So make sure it is in here. If you don't have that, make sure you do Create it. Now from here, what we're going to want to do, just hover over any of these. Click on the little file icon just here. Now this will load up our .minecraft folder. And in here, we want to locate our mods folder. Now if you don't have a mods folder, simply right click, New, Folder. Like that, just like that. So in here, simply just type in mods like that and then click on enter on your keyboard. Now, as I already got a mods folder, I don't need to do this. So I'm actually going to get rid of this file. I don't need that file as I've already got one up here. So my mods folder is already here. I'm going to double click into my mods folder. Now in here, we actually want to drag in our mod we downloaded from Curse Forage. Now mine is actually on my desktop just here. Mouse tweaks. I'm going to just put this in here like that. Click on the little X button. Come back over to your Minecraft launcher. Click on play. Then click on play just here. Now you might get a warning on the screen. If you do, just click on I understand and click on play. So I'm now in Minecraft and the mods are already working. So if you want to find out if they're working, click on the escape key. And right here we've got mods. Click on that. And in here we can see we've actually got our mouse tweaks mod in here. So that is how you install it for Forage. I'm now going to show you how to do it for Fabric. So I'm now on the Fabric website. I will leave a link in the description down below to this website. From here, click on download for Windows. Now that will download just here. We're also going to want to look for some mods, so go over to Curse Forage just here. What we're going to want to do from here is make sure we've got Fabric selected and uncheck Forage, as we don't want Forage mods with Fabric as it won't work. So make sure you've got Fabric selected, choose your game version down here, then simply scroll through and have a look for what mods you want. Again, I'm going to be downloading this one just here, Mouse Tweaks, click on that. Then from here, simply click on Files, scroll down, and what we're going to want to do is actually look for the Fabric version just here. Make sure it's got the right version here, 1.21.1. Click on the three little dots, click on download just here. Now that will download as well after about five seconds. And also for Fabric, we're also going to want to download the Fabric API. 
So make sure you do this as well. Click on the files icon just here, scroll down. And from here, what we're gonna wanna do is actually look for the version we are playing, which is this one just here, 1.21.1. Three little dots over here, then click on download. So I'm now on my desktop, simply go to your downloads folder. Mine is just here. Drag these out onto your desktop, just like that. Again, you are gonna need Java to make this work. So be sure to check out that video, links in the description down below. To actually get Java, it's very easy to do. So the first thing we're gonna to wanna to do from here is actually just install the fabric installer just here. Double click on this file. Now this will load up a little menu just like this one. In here, choose your game version. So for me, I'm doing the 1.21.1. .1. Click on that version, then click on install just here. There we go, that took about a couple of seconds or so. Click on OK, click on the little X button. You can now get rid of this file. We don't need that file no more. Now what we're gonna to wanna to do is actually load up our Minecraft launcher. Now inside of our Minecraft launcher, you can see down here we've got fabric automatically selected. Now if you don't have fabric down here, what you're gonna to wanna to do is come up to the installations up here. Make sure you've got the modded selected over here. Make sure that is selected. Then from here, you should see the uh, fabric in here. If you don't see it in here, what you're gonna to wanna to do is click on new installations just here. Then in here, click on the versions. Simply just search for fabric. So here we are, the fabric is just here. So select that one. That is the newest version for Minecraft, as you can see, 1.21.1. .1. Give it a name, give it an icon just here, then click on create down here. Now only do this if you don't have it in here. So next, what we're gonna to wanna to do is click on the little file icon just over here, click on that. This will load up our .minecraft folder. Now in here, what we're gonna to wanna to do is actually look for our mods folder just here. Now if you don't have a mods folder, so if I delete my mods folder, if you don't have a mods folder like this, right click in here, hover over new, click on folder just here and simply just search in mods or just type in mods just like that click on enter now we have got our mods folder double click into your mods folder now from here we're actually going to want to drag in our mouse tweaks just drag that in like that we also want to install our fabric api as well so simply move this over to the side drag in your fabric api then click on the close button just there come back over to minecraft come over to play make sure the uh, fabric is selected over here click on play now you might get a warning on the screen if you do, just click on I understand and click on play. So we're now in Minecraft and that's how you install mods for Fabric as well. So if this video was helpful for you, be sure to leave a like on it. Also check out this video here on the screen if you want to get more FPS in Minecraft. But that is it for this video. Hopefully you have all enjoyed and I'll see you all in my next video.